Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. It's your glutton Matt having some donuts today. So I'm attempting to do this donut video for the second time. So I'm here in Mr. Donuts and I went and I got 18 of their donuts. So let's get right into them. I don't know which one I'm gonna start with. There's actually like a bunch here you can't see. So there's, there's gonna be two rounds. The first one and then the second round. It's the first tray and then the second tray. So let's just start with I think this is the, this is like a, it's like a cooler, but it's like got angel cream on this inside of it. Mm. Mm. That went down really, really easy. Okay, so it's just like a plain, they call them pom de rings, I think. sure like I think like pom de ring is like actually like a French term or something correct me if I'm wrong in the comments so here's another pom de ring this one's like pink and sparkly yeah strawberry and sparkly I don't know oh yeah for sure strawberry I think, I think I have like four different kinds of those, four different kinds of pond rings. Okay. I'm obviously trying to speak low today because I'm, I'm inside if you didn't notice. I'm actually really surprised that like, I just, I just, I just bought the donuts and then like went and found like a corner and just set up without even asking anyone. I thought that would be like cinnamon, but it's just, it's just like, it looks cinnamony, but it's not really like, I don't know what that is. It's got like some sort of gritty stuff on it. Yeah, like, so each of those is like made up of individual like circles to make the whole ring. Mm. It's definitely not Definitely not as picturesque of a setting as my the first donut video that I attempted and failed, but it is what it is, right? I thought it'd be at least kind of interesting doing an in in, in restaurant video too. So let's go with here's a double chocolate guy. <laughs> Some little girl just like saying hi to me there. At least like interactions between people might make it interesting. I'm just too bad I got a wall behind me. I guess I could eat in the other way, but I didn't want to like have it facing so like people got purposely on camera. But, so we won't have any guys dancing behind me today. Okay. Let's go on to just a plain old fashioned like cake donut sort of thing. I actually like these a lot. Mm. I never used to like these donuts. I used to, I, I didn't try one of these until my very first like Tim Hortons donut video. And then as soon as I had one, I just, I, I love them. They're good. They're not, they're not a cake donut. They're a sour cream glazed donut, I think. That's what they call them, the sour cream. I always used to look at those and be like, sour cream glazed donut, like, how can that be good? Mm. There's just like another little boy like walking past and he stopped and actually like was looking at what I was doing. When I was in line, because this Mr. Donuts, like, you grab your tray and like tongs and you like slide it along and you can open up the cases and you grab the donuts yourselves. 
So like the people like in next in line to me, they're just like, they're looking at me and just like giggling the entire time. Like, what is this guy doing? Okay. So let's go on to the next pone dudding. So it's like a chocolate sprinkle. You can basically just pull them right apart like that. I'm not sure what this is. It looks like another, it's like a sour cream. A sour cream donut, but with a chocolate, chocolate topping to it, with like a little some eyes and like some sprinkles there. I'm not sure exactly what it's supposed to be, but it's good. It's good. Mm. This coffee's not gonna be enough for me either. I snuck some drinks in my bag. But I thought I'd just like buy like buy a coffee, just like a single coffee, just to be not be suspicious, or conspicuous, conspicuous. So after I'm done that, I'm gonna have to pull out my own drinks. I bought like just over twenty dollars worth of donuts, though. Shouldn't matter if I bring my own drinks or not. down so let's have some of these pokemon ones these aren't they don't have the pokemon ones that i had in the video i failed they just have like these like it's like a pikachu colored one but is not they don't actually have the actual pikachu donut in stock i was kind of disappointed i really wanted to eat those in this video but i guess it was just you can't choose everything 100 percent right it's got a sort of it's got like two different fillings in there. It's like a it's got that like white one and maybe a custard in there. But if you don't know what donuts I'm talking about either, I put a picture on my Instagram. So go check out my Instagram if you haven't. There was like an actual Pikachu donut and then like a snow Pikachu donut. Mm. I like these little bags that come in though. So this is like a Jigglypuff sort of theme color one, but I guess it's just like just like a strawberry. It looks like it's like kind of like a cooler almost. I don't know what you'd call that. But again, it's got like a filling in there. Mm. It's got both of those fillings. Same as the Pikachu one. It's good though. They're good donuts, so I'll give that. Mm-mm. Mm -mm. Plate two down. Let's go on to plate three and four. I only got 18 donuts today. I, was, I thought two dozen might just be a little bit too much. So let's go on to the final pone de ring. It's got like a white sort of frost into it with sprinkles. I actually probably couldn't have filmed outside today anyway because it was not a nice day at all. So it was either like do it in the restaurant or not do it at all. I was worried I'd like, I was worried I'd get the donuts, try to go sit down and then they'd kick me out and then they'd like, I'd have like a bunch of donuts that I didn't know what to do with. I'm not even at my next city either. I had a long trip today. So I finished, I got out of the mountains and I'm back in civilization now, but it was like gonna take me like, I was going back to Osaka and it was like a foot, it was like a, almost a five hour train ride from where I finished in the mountains to Osaka. So I stopped here on the way to shoot a video like before it got dark out. Cause it'd be dark out in Osaka before I got there. Okay, 
So this is just like a raised, I, this might be like an angel donut. I don't know, it's just like a raised sugar donut. Just a plain sugar donut. Mm. So yeah, it was a really, really rainy day today. I'm actually here a lot later than, like my overall trip's a lot later than it's supposed to be because my initial train got delayed by like, well, the first train I was supposed to take got like canceled. So I had to wait till the next train, which was not for another two hours. So overall, I'm like two hours behind schedule. Okay, here we go. French cooler. This is an angel cream donut, I know for sure. This has got an angel cream filling to it. Mm. 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 All these donuts are a lot, a lot lighter than what we'd have back like in North America for sure, but then like Canada. Like, they're like way more lighter. They don't sit as heavy in my stomach. That one's got custard. Yeah, I feel like, I feel like after this many donuts of like back home, I'd really be feeling it by now. I'm gonna pull out one of my drinks. Try to keep it sort of hidden. I'll keep it down there somewhere. Okay, so I basically got just like three ring donuts left. So this one, this one's just, I, I guess I got two of these. <laughs> like the amount of donuts I got, I almost like cleaned the whole place out. There was some like, I could have got other ones that were different, but that just didn't really appeal to me. Like there was another like chocolate one with like, I think they called it a golden chocolate, which I had in my previous video, which I thought it was going to be like a toasted coconut, but like it had like the yellow sort of sprinkles on it, but like it didn't taste coconutty at all. So I wasn't really a big fan of it. So I didn't get it a second time around. Okay, so this is just like a plain, they call that a honey raised, I think. Mm. Mm. I think, I don't think Mr. Donuts, Mr. Donut, is like original to Japan. I think it's actually just a Dunkin' Donuts. Just, they renamed it here. Or like, I think the history of it was like, it was always like, the original name was Mr. Donuts. And then they renamed it Dunkin' Donuts in the States, but it like stayed Mr. Donuts here. I'm not sure. I think that's how it goes. I could be wrong. I've been known to be wrong lots. So this is another like raised, plain raised donut, but with a strawberry frosting on top. But we don't have Dunkin' Donuts in Canada either, so this is still different for me. Even if it is just a Dunkin' Donuts rename. It's always nice, it's always cool like still like go to other restaurants in like another country to see what they have different. Like like those pone de rings. Like we don't have like those pone de rings in Canada. Like Japan's the only place, I mean, I'm sure they have, must have them in other countries and stuff. Cause I know they have Mr. Donuts and Mr. Donut in other Asian countries like Thailand and stuff. But like I've never, like before I ever came to, came to Japan, i would never seen a pone de, ring, pone de ring donut. This is the only time I ever have those. There we go. 
all four plates down. And that wasn't even that hard. Like I said, they're pretty light. And they just, they don't like, they're not like a hard rock of like sugar and like dough in my stomach. I actually don't feel that bad because like compared to like some of my previous donut videos where like I just want to like pass out and die after I've done them. That was pretty good though. But I need to be going on my way, catch the next train to Osaka. So I got to get out of here really quick. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Give it a like, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you guys next time in the next video. Until then, peace out.